We're here at the Cinch Stadium in Franklin's Gardens for the annual Grant Thornton Northamptonshire Limited. In 2022, we're going to look at the turnover of the top 100 companies in Northamptonshire who have combined a massive £9.1 billion in turnover. Northamptonshire's performance this year, uh, it's been a fantastic, uh, it's been a fantastic performance uh, from the top 100 businesses, a real return to growth uh, after a disrupted uh, pandemic year. Um, in terms of its performance uh, against neighbouring kind of counties, uh, from a revenue perspective, it's on par um, in terms of the return to there. What it's really stood out from is actually its EBITDA and profitability margins. I think our view on Northamptonshire Limited is uh, a, a great report this year, um, a real kind of stamp of approval in terms of the local economy and kind of the, the county strength. Um, what we're really keen to do is actually capitalise on that fantastic return to growth um, and really in terms of making sure we're attracting the right talent, providing the right infrastructure, so jobs, homes and opportunities for people to really keep our talent uh, in the local area. It's often been a drain to London and Birmingham, um, but now we think that the county's businesses can really keep the top talent and that's really key for us and, and Grant Thornton wants to support businesses in being able to do that. A big focus of ours has always been our team and our culture, you know, um, we've got a brilliant team, very proud that they, majority of them live and work in Northamptonshire. Um, we continue to always try and recruit and uh, look after our team, listening to what's important to them, you know, so putting policies in place and uh, procedures in place that supports our talent is key and will continue to be. Um, we believe there's great talent in and around Northamptonshire, so continuing to promote that and bringing people into the town and keeping people in the town is um, really important to us. 